Reno Mokri, a social political analyst, has claimed that the North and South will continue to control political power in Nigeria. And these have generated a lot of reactions. As we progress, we hear what Nigerians have said concerning this statement. Hello guys, if you are just joining us, I beg subscribe to this channel, share this video, like us, I beg, thank you for let's stopping by. Omokri said both regions will continue to yield political power over Nigeria due to their unity and humility. Posting on X, the former presidential aide said, after regions, we assume control of political power in Nigeria when they learn humility and unity from the north and the western part of the country. According to Omokri, sadly, as long as Nigeria remains one united country, the northern Nigeria and the southwest of Nigeria will continue controlling power in this political aspect, like Itanisbo, because of their unity and humility. One we do eight years, God willing, and pass the ball with their rockets of unity to the other, who will do their own eight years and pass the ball back. Only the death of an incumbent president can temporarily break that, that circle. And if that even occurs, this swing will be readjusted back to its original factory, setting during elections, and that will be retained. Except other regions learn unity and humility from these two blocks, this political tennis game of back and front we endure. Unity without humility will result in feelings of supreme, supremacy, which will destroy your political ability. Humility without unity will lead to internal geopolitical uh, winglings, which cause political instability. To get power and retain it in a multi-ethnic polity like ours, you must uh, counterbalance it unity with humanity and the north especially the core north and the southwest get it oh yeah insert he said because their survivor depends on it it's also the north and west are parasites with no resources and they are being used by their british government our colonial masters for their selfish gains and the North and the West are not educated enough to understand this. Yoruba really lack senso to repose as a writer right quoted. Oh yeah now, the South is the most educated region in Nigeria. Please, school us, we are ready and willing to learn. As your survivor, it's not depend on Nigeria politics. Why is it that Peter B and his Igbo siblings are on their way to hospital admission, to mortuaries and for onwards to sanctuary, a cemetery, because Peter B was defeated in the 23rd presidential election? Why is B sinking? Substandard boroughs in all northern states where he was not even welcomed. Why Amanda and Obi? What is that lady, Amanda Obi? What is that lady, horrible name, written letters to Joe Biden and all world leaders to come and recount Nigerian's presidential election results and declared Obi winner as Igbo survivor? It's not depend on Nigerian politics. Why? Is Simon Ekba is crazy and crying in diaspora? Omo Ibo, patriotism, honestly and undiluted uh, sincerity in characteristics or in characters that propel one to high heights, not self-titlement, desperation, egoism, frustrations, propagandas, anxiety, uncertainty, untrustworthiness, scammers, murderous lifestyle, mend your ways and be human. Hmm. You really lack sense 
to reason as you do. Oh yeah, now South East has the most educated person. You say, Mr. Item, shut up your mouth too. And cross rivers are now house boys in Lagos before the Orie, the western region of far gone in education and farming. First, TV station was built with cocoa. When on a start to see Oya money. Okay, guys, these are reactions from Nigerians. As you can see, that reactions are getting tough. I think uh, Reno Mokri is not making sense at all. Because we don't only have the, the North and the Southwest in Nigeria. If we are talking about equity, if we are talking about fairness and justice, every region should be carried along. I will not say, oh, because I am from the Southwest, or I am from the North, or I'm from the Southeast, and whatever. Then we should just, you know, face these two regions. This is unfair. And this will continue to cause problems. It's like Renault Mercury is not thinking rightly. He doesn't know that this will cause more problems. If only the, the North and the Southwest get to be controlling Nigeria. So what happens to other regions? Are they, not, are they less Nigerians? Is that what Renault Mercury is trying to prove? There are some times it's better you don't talk. Because when you talk, your talk, if your talk is not making sense, it will come be like say person non normal. You understand? There are things you say. Okay? There are things you say. Well, I'm dropping it here, guys. What's your take on this one? I beg share. Make me hear from you. Share this video.